hello everyone let's solve this problem very quickly we have x to the power of 1 over 2 plus x equal to 3 okay so what do i do x to the power of 1 over 2 is equal to 3 minus x what i have done is to take x to the right hand side now we can remove this power of 1 over 2 by squaring both sides to the power of 1 over 2 squared equal to 3 minus x squared this and this will cancel so that x will be equal to 3 minus x multiplied by 3 minus x x is equal to 3 times 3 is 9 3 times minus x is minus 3x minus x times 3 is minus 3x and minus x times minus x is plus x squared so x is equal to 9 minus 6x plus x um, squared okay so now from here i want us to rearrange this so i have x to be equal to x squared minus 6x then plus 9 okay so this is also the same thing as um, x squared minus 6x plus 9 equal to 0 okay is equal to x because I had, I'm having x on this side. And now let's bring everything to the left. So we have x squared minus 6x minus x plus 9 equals 0. So that's from here. We have um, x squared minus 7x plus 9 equals 0. We have a quadratic equation to solve. But what do we do? Remember we may not be able to factorize this in fact we can't factorize this but we can use um, formula method to solve this and if you're going to use formula method a is the coefficient of x squared which is 1 b is a coefficient of x which is minus 7 and then c is the constant which is 9 okay and the formula is x is equal to minus b positive or negative square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a so this is um, quadratic general formula we are looking for x and it's equal to minus minus 7 because b is minus 7 this one is this and for b we have minus 7 positive or negative we have b squared which will be minus 7 squared then um, minus 4 times a is 1 then times c what is our c c is 9 so i write 9 over here and the whole of this is over 2 times 1 which is 2 and then x will be equal to negative negative will give us positive 7 plus or minus okay we'll take a step further minus 7 squared is 49 then minus 4 times 9 will give us 36 right and this is over 2 we take a step forward x is equal to 7 positive or negative and then i have 49 minus um, 36 will give us 13 we're going to have 13 and this is over 2 okay so what does this mean this means that um, we are going to have two values for x x is equal to 7 plus square root of 13 over 2 or 7 minus okay we have 7 minus square root of 13 over 2 now we can decide to proceed so we have x to be equal to 7 over 2 plus root 13 
over 2. In fact, let's call this our x1. And then our x2 is equal to 7 over 2 minus square root of 13 over 2. Okay, so these two are the values of x that will satisfy the given equation. Thank you for watching.